Hi guys, my name is Jonathan Smith from Young Health Electronic Team. Today I'm going to present the BB Doctor Blood Monitor Watch to you. Introducing BB Doctor, a smartwatch combining blood pressure monitoring, heart rate variability analysis, and blood oxygen tracking into smartwatch. And we made a BB Doctor that works hard to monitor your personal health so you don't have to. Using the BP Doctor is simple, short, and definitely less painful than whatever the nurse does to you. It's the most convenient monitor, simply to wear on your wrist, and you will be ready to go. A lot of people might tell you that keeping a track of your blood pressure is very important to your health, but the hustle of carrying heavy equipment can keep you away from a good habit of everyday monitoring and have your condition under control. And that's the truly portable blood pressure monitor BP comes into play. The reason why we made such a watch is because monitoring a blood pressure seems difficult and hard to achieve. To get an accurate measurement, you need to carry this kind of device, or you need to go to the hospital or clinic. Imagine diabetic patient like me or my father need to bring a blood pressure monitor like this to work every day. It is so big and not user friendly, especially for the ladies carrying a lot of stuff in their bags every day. This would be too much for them. So we wanted to make a small, variable, convenient blood pressure monitor that can track your blood pressure anytime, anywhere. Compared to this, BP Doctor is variable, convenient, and just as accurate as a traditional one. This thing is so different from any other blood pressure device that you can find on the market. The design of BP Doctor involves more than 30 new patents, miniaturized the components for the traditional asiometric measurements. Using the inflatable cuff within the watch to take the blood pressure. Underneath the strap, there is a cuff that inflates to measure systolic and diastolic pressure by the asiometric method. Basically, that's the same technique used at your doctor's office where they strap and inflate a cuff on your arm, except this one is much smaller. Simple, easy, and you are ready to go. Okay, fellas, so it's the time for our little experiment. Uh, we will compare this. Uh, which is a traditional device that we can use for measuring the blood pressure and then we have our smartwatch device so first as you can see this thing is too big to carry our watch very easy to wear just put it on your wrist easy okay another difficulty that you need to face you need to find the place where you plug it in so we plugged it here then, usually, you just put it here. Actually, for the sake of this experiment, I needed to take off my shirt. This, you don't need to take on everything. Anything, you just put it on your wrist. And it's done. You don't need to take off. You are ready to go. And now, breathe in, breathe out, okay, we are calm, so we will start. Simple push, okay.
here we are down. And the result is amazing. Really, really, look at it. Look at this. Look, look, closer, closer. Come in. It's the same. If you, if you look here, the difference is very slight, like just the three degrees, uh, just the three points. Here, diastolic pressure, same, exactly, on spot. Pulse, also on spot, exactly the same. So this gives you a proof that using our smart device and this old machinery to measure your blood pressure makes no sense anymore. Right now we live in a new era where you can use simple watch to measure your blood pressure. Uh, right now we are continuing our experiment. So uh, what we've done so far is that before previously we did uh, one experiment. I was sitting here being calm and we were measuring the blood pressure on this and on our smartwatch. Uh, so basically results were amazing. Uh, we proved that our smartwatch working very good. And now we move uh, to another part of our test. I'll be doing some exercising to see the difference between both of the devices. So let me do some push-ups, let me do some squats, and then we will measure the blood pressure. So let's go. It used to be better, but you know, everybody is getting older. So, very important thing, you need to make sure that everything is plugged in. Our smartwatch has a one big advantage. It's on me all the time, anyway. So, we are already here, it's plugged in, so we start to measure. One push here, another here, and Let's take a look. Oh my god! Yeah, it's working. It's working, guys, guys, guys. Come on. So let's take a closer look. Yeah, I put it closer. Actually, I don't need it anymore. So uh, let, let's take a look here. Everything is within uh, the norm. So as you can see, uh, the systolic pressure. 144, uh, here you have 145. Diastolic is 74, here you have 69, and the pulse is almost the same, but the only difference is uh, one point. So, uh, to understand this properly, uh, anything within uh, five points of uh, difference is still calculated as okay. So, you don't need to be worried. Our watch proved that within the medical devices, we are still accurate. It's very important to say this because you can have two of these and the difference could be the same like between the watches and another device. So we are spot on and we proved that this device is useful and very accurate. Okay. Thank you very much for finding some time out out of your busy schedule. I just want to note one more time that this is just a prototype and we really need your help and support. 
uh, because all of these innovation it takes a lot of effort it takes a lot of research and a lot of, of our energy so we hope that in the future we can give you the better more innovative products but we need your support so hopefully with the time passing by and with your support uh, we can make this to be helpful for everybody. Thank you very much guys. See you next session.